I'm Lindsay Vareshko, and this is my Katy Perry undercover stampede story. Back in 2011, we booked Katy Perry to play our Saddledome concert series for Stampede Time. And at the time, she was one of the most monstrous celebrities in the world. Her album was hitting the top of the charts basically with every single she put out. Not only that, she was married to Russell Brand, which obviously puts you in the tabloids almost every day. So when she came to Calgary, she had a whole day off before her show. And so naturally, she kind of wanted to do what any other 26-year-old would do during Stampede in July, which is kind of experience Stampede and get to see what there is to do there. And so one of the biggest problems though, when you're Katy Perry and you're one of the most recognizable people in the world is how you do that without getting harassed or, or followed all day by all your fans. The solution was, was pretty simple. Um, you, you get cowboyed up. You try and look like the rest of Calgary during Stampede. So we helped her out. We got her a plaid shirt and some jeans and boots and a bedazzled belt buckle. She added her own wig and sunglasses, and then she hit the midway. She did all the things that regular people do. And she was out there for a few hours. She rode the rides, she had some turkey legs, she had corn on the cob, and no one recognized her, if you can believe it. She got to be herself and have fun, just like any other Calgarian would for a few hours. And then she took some selfies, which was incredible, and posted them all over social media. And then she went and played a giant show to a giant audience in the Saddledome that night. <laughs> 